What's going on, everyone? This is your boy, Ron Beckles, DFS Greatness, man. We got a four-game slate for this Saturday, February 13th, man. I um, hope everybody having a good Saturday, man. Hope everybody, everybody been winning money, man. But um, before I start my video, if you feel like this video is helpful, just like the page, subscribe to my channel. That's all I'm telling you guys. I'm not here to give you a lineup. I'm not here just like, you know, building lineups. I'm not doing that. I'm on Draft Dashboard, just giving you guys the top plays that y'all should put in your lineup. Simple as that, man. Um, also, man, you can follow me on Twitter, DFS Greatness on Twitter. If you need any help, advice, making lineups, any advice, man, I'm here to help you guys out, man. Let's get to it, man. Saturday, we only got four games slate. We had a monster slate last night, man. But, all right, I love it. I love short slates, man. I feel like, you know, you can win some good money, man. Um, let's get to it. Um, point guard tonight, man, um, at 10400 If you want to spin up for James Harden, he's um, $100 cheap on FanDuel. Um, he's averaging 53.2 fantasy points a game, 40, 62, and 53, 26% usage rate. Um, KD will be back tonight. His usage should go down a lot, so I'm not going to have that much exposure to James Harden. But at 10100 man, he's $700 more on FanDuel. Let me get Chef Curry with this three, man. Curry's been cooking lately, man, averaging 49.6 fantasy points a game, 68, 42, 54, man, 33% usage rate. I'm going to like Curry tonight, man. Um, he's projected at 50 fantasy points. That's just about five times value. Um, you know, Curry's playing good ball, man. This guy is hitting both five, five or six threes a game, and I know this game is going to be something that they're going against KD, man. So, you know, I know Curry's going to come and bring it. You know, the um, Nets do not play good defense. You know, their team is struggling lately. And so that's one of my favorite guards I like tonight. And another guy, if you want to go look at him at 8,100, averaging 40 fantasy points a game, 45, 63, and 58. Man, whatever Shaq said to Donovan Mitchell, man, this guy has been balling, man. You know, Shaq said he came, um, I guess, reach another level. Wasn't that good, you know. Just salt, you know, just salt to a slug, man. Just say little things, salty, you know. That's what a lot of old guys, man, once they retire, man, they just be in their feelings, you know, just judging people, you know, critiquing players and all that type of stuff. But, you know, 8,100, I, I definitely like the price tag. He's $200 more on FanDuel. I was just going off, man. He's projected 41 fantasy points. It's five times value. I'm going against um, the Heat, man. I'm against the point guards. They're 25th rank. So, last three games, going against Miami, 43, 32, and 35. Um, I definitely like that Don Mitchell tonight, man. You know, he's playing good. You know, if I can get this guy 8,100, he can give me 41, 41 fence points, five times value. I like the price tag a lot. Um, if you want to go look at another guy, um, at 7,200, John Wall, $300 more on FanDuel, going against New York, man. Average of 35.6 fantasy points a game. Get around 36 fantasy points is five times value, 29% usage rate. Um, he should have a good usage tonight. I think Victor Oladipo, I don't think he's going to play. He got hurt. Um, I had him other night, killed my lineup. Um, I definitely like that price tag for him. I'm at 5800 um, It was $200 cheaper on FanDuel. Eric Gordon, man, um, he needs around 29 fantasy points, five times value. He's really scored a pennant. He really don't feel a stat sheet with rebounds and assists. He, he just shoot threes and everything. So, you know, since um, Oladipo might not be playing tonight, I don't know if he's going to start. So, if he does start, I definitely like the price tag for him. And, um... If I want to go cheaper, you got the six man a year. If you want to put a bet in, you know, put a bet in for on the gig, you should win six man a year. Seven hundred dollars cheaper on FanDuel. So he's um averaging 28.9 fantasy points, 41, 24, 25. Playing in just around starter minutes, man. I like the price tag for Jordan Clarkson. And if you always look at short, short Jordan Clarkson, you go look at his shots. All three pointers. He takes about 10 threes a game. So that's good if you ever want to take Jordan Clarkson for a prop bet. Um, he's projected to get 29 fantasy points, 5.5 times value, man. I like the price tag for him, man. Um, I think Mike Conley's still out, so he's definitely getting a lot of minutes. They're on the back-to-back, -back, but, you know, Miami, they don't scare me. Miami do not look like the team that was in the bubble. Now, if I want to go cheap at point guard, um, I like 4,800. Derrick Rose, he, he back with Tibbs, his old coach, $400 more on FanDuel. Um, Derrick Rose averaged 25.7 fantasy points a game um, since he came back, man. He's getting around 22 minutes a game. 24.3 fantasy points he projected is five times value. I definitely like um, Derrick Rose, man, you know, with the second unit coming off the bench scoring. 
Um, I look, a guy I've been getting hell of minutes, man. Kendrick Nunn, after 23.7 fantasy points a game, he's 600 cheap on FanDuel. So I like, like to perform FanDuel parties. He's getting a lot of minutes to start in point guard with Drogic being out, man. Um, last year's guy was up there with um, John Moran for rookie of the year, but you know, once the bubble and everything went, it just um, he like he was he got a lot of rotation. It was it was pretty ugly, man. I didn't, didn't like how the coach played the system with that one. It was kind of crazy. But um, if I did go cheaper, uh, that's probably the cheapest plays I will recommend you guys to put in your lineup tonight. Yeah, that's a pr pretty much cheaper. Yeah, that's about it, man, for the point guard. For my favorite point guard tonight, I'm going to be honest with you, Donovan Mitchell, Stephen Curry, John Wall. I like Eric Gordon, Jordan Clarkson. Key ingredients to make successful lineups. Throw, your, throw, your, throw them guys in your lineup. You want high uses player, um, if players. Um, Let's get to it, man. With the shooting guard on DraftKings tonight, if you want to go look at Tyler Hero, Sitting at 31.7 fantasy points a game. It's 200 yards cheap on FanDuel. You can go that direction with him. And um, also, Andre Wiggins, 400 yards more on FanDuel. Averaging 30.9 fantasy points a game. Somehow, Andre Wiggins sometimes come to play in big games. 6,400. He around 30. From, from, he's projected to get 31 fantasy points, 4.9 fast value. He's 400 yards cheap on FanDuel. So, his draft is probably is a key. Uh, another guy, 5,700. Joe Ingles. Uh, average of 24.3 fantasy points a game, man. He's playing good, man. I mean, he's not starting like he was at first, but he's coming off the bench and hooping. Um, he's $900 more on FanDuel. Definitely like the price tag, man. I think he's in a good match against Miami. And another guy I like to play a lot, man, Joe Harris. He's starting for the Nets, 5,600, averaging 24.8 fantasy points a game. Um, he do have upside, three-point upside, four-point He's projected to get 24.5 fantasy points a game, 4.5 value. Definitely like it, man. Drogic, I don't do not think he's playing. And um, you want to look at guys, cheap guys, recommend, 4,600. Um, Duncan Robinson, he really don't have upside, three-point upside. That's it. <clears throat> if you want to go look at this, it, all he really shoot threes. The Atlanta Hawks, man, got, got smacked last night, man. That was crazy. Did not see that coming at all. Um, if I want to look at cheap guys, that's about it. Um, 3,100, just a GPP dart, Aaron Holiday. if you want to look at him. Yeah, the shooting guards tonight is pretty terrible. Um, Jordan Clark's the air going, Taylor Hero, Donovan Mitchell, James Harden. The cream of the oh, – you can look at Malcolm Brogdon. Atlanta's on a back-to-back, 7,500, averaging 39.8 fantasy points a game, 300 cheap on FanDuel. That's about it at shooting guard. <clears throat> small four tonight, man. One of my favorite small fours. I'm, I'm, I'm pulling in a lot of lineups tonight. It's Kelly Oubre. He's averaging um 26.9 fantasy points a game. Last three games, 38, 30, and 36, man, with 22% usage rate. Going against um Golden's going against um, Brooklyn. They defense running 2026 as a whole. He's projected to get he's um projected to get 29.6 fantasy points, 4.7 times value. I feel like Kelly Oubre will go over there tonight. And if you want to go to the very top, man, I didn't mention Jimmy Butler, man. This guy's been playing out of his mind, trying to get Miami back in the playoffs. He's averaging 43.2 fantasy points a game. 56, 56, 57, 56, 45. Um, he's $700 um, more on FanDuel, so I like DraftKings price. Projected to get 44.8 fantasy points tonight. That's 5.4 times value. If you want to go that direction with Jimmy Butler. And a guy I've been playing a lot, man. Cheap guy, value play. 4,300 is uh, Doug McDermott. Averaging 20.9 fantasy points a game. 15, 20, and 30. 20% 20 use rate. He's 200 jobs more on FanDuel. If you want to go that direction with him on that one. And um, this guy right here, man. Juan Tisco Anderson, averaging 4,900. Um, he's, um, he's averaging 18 fantasy points a game, 22, 30, and 24. He's starting $300 more on FanDuel. He's in a good matchup, man. Brooklyn defense is terrible, terrible. I would be surprised if he cut the game on um, Golden State's beating about 10 or 15 points early in the game. Having three, two, three superstars on one team, man, it don't jail well. Look at the Miami Heat back in the day. Didn't jail well today, but the chemistry. And right now, they don't have the chemistry. 
Jay Sean Tate, 4,700, averaging 20.6 um, fantasy points a game, 30, 25, and 23. He's $900 more on FanDuel, so I like the draft in his price. I'm um, looking at minutes. He's playing like 34, 28. He can start minutes, man. I like a guy like that. That's a good um, value play. I think he's a fantastic matchup. And if I want to go cheaper, 4,200, Daniel House, averaging 19.9 fantasy points a game, 17, 37, 20, with a 15% usage rate. If I want to go cheaper at the position. And that's about it, man. I'm um, liking small forward position. Kelly Uber, Jimmy Buckets. I love Dove and Durbin, man. Just like um, value plays, man. Power forward tonight. That's a lot of good power forwards. Favorite power forward tonight, 9,600. Um, it's Kevin Durant. He's back from quarantine, um, from COVID. You know, he didn't have COVID exposed to when his friends are headed. He's four hundred dollars more on FanDuel. I love the matchup tonight. I don't know, you know, he's going back to Golden State, but no fans tonight, so I don't know how KD is going to play. But I like the price tag for him. I feel like I see double double upside for um, KD tonight. I like the price tag for him. Another guy I like Sabonis, man, averaging forty six point seven fantasy points a game, six hundred dollars more on FanDuel, fifty nine forty one and forty. He's averaging he's projected to get forty five point one fantasy points five times value, man. He's all they got, man. He got Miles Turner in the paint. He in the, the three-point line shooting threes. Getting the pain miles turning and um, post people up. See, that's what Sabonis doing. He get all the points, man. Um, against Atlanta's averaging 40 fantasy points a game. Atlanta's on a back-to-back. -back, so, I definitely like Sabonis for that price tag. Julius Randle, no Christian Woods, 8,700. Like the price tag, averaging 47.2 fantasy points a game, 55, 30, and 56. 100 dollars cheap on fan duel. I definitely like um, Julius Randle for the price tag, man. Mr. Triple Double Upside, Draymond Green, 6,700. Wiseman still out. He's not $100 more on FanDuel, 37, 32, and 40. Um, I definitely like the price set for Draymond Green. I feel like he got a lot of upside, man. Just a cheap play. If you want to spin up for these top guys, Draymond Green, definitely like him, man. And one of my favorite plays, I play him all the time, definitely in prop bets, is Kelly Olenek. Um, he's hundred dollars cheap on FanDuel, twenty four point three fantasy points. This guy get rebounds, he shoot threes, and he make buckets, man. Maybe a steal or two on there. Um, twenty six, twenty eight, and twenty seven. I like the price tag for him a lot, man. I think um, good price tag for Kelly Olynyk. Juan Anderson mentioned this guy earlier. Tate. I'm just looking at value plays, man. If you want to get Royce O'Neal, forty four hundred. Don't have that much upside. Just a cheap play you can throw in your lineup. He's averaging twenty two point three fantasy points a game, thirteen, twenty one, and eighteen. He's four hundred dollars more on FanDuel, and um, and that's about it, man. PJ Tucker's out there. He played hella minutes. Don't do hell, hell of nothing. <laughs> Just be out there. Um, Jeff Green, bench role player. Price tag is too high for um, um KD's coming back. TLC man, Cabaret, thirty eight hundred. You know this guy come off the bench. Um, he's averaging nineteen minutes a game. And that's about it if I would recommend you guys, man. But top of the line, man, it's um, power forward. KD Sabonis, Randall, Draymond, Draymond Green, Kelly Olenek. A my, my, few of my favorite plays for tonight, man. Um, let's get the center. I'm at the center tonight. You mentioned KD and Sabonis, man. Um, Bam Ayobayo averaging. Um, 42.2 fantasy points a game. I'm um, in a good matchup, man. Gets you on know, Utah back to back. Um, he's um averaging 33 minutes a game, 25 percent use rate, $500 more on Fanduel. Definitely like the price tag for Bama Bio. Um, if you don't want to spend up for the price tag, um, Draymond Green, Power Force, Small for eligible. You definitely like the matchup for him. But um, Kelly Olenek, you mentioned him earlier, power four center, eligible. Miles Turner, I'm not really high. He's so cheap, man. This guy just, you know, for him to be successful, I think he got to get more in the paint, man. Get Shooting three-pointers, man. Get in the paint, get some rebounds. And one of my favorite players, 6,500. I like um, DeMarcus Cousins. Hey, he's one of the good guys can go off against New York, man. Mitchell Robinson, I think he fractured his hand something last night. So it's 25.7 fantasy points a game, averaging 19 minutes a game. 24% use rate, $300 cheap on FanDuel. I hate he's not getting 30 minutes, man. It's not the DeMarcus Cousin back in the day. Sacramento was a dog. It's not what we want to get. But you want to look at guys, 3,900, Noah's Noel, man. I'm just telling you, Mitchell Robinson, I think he broke fractured something last night. Noah's Noel probably get the start tonight. 3,900, that would definitely be 
highly on value play for tonight. Uh, I guarantee he will be value on. And that's about it, man, for the song for the centers tonight. I'm gonna recommend you guys to go with. Yeah, man, favorite center tonight, man, power four center. You got KD, Bam Adebayo, Sabonis, man. I'm just looking at match of Draymond Green, Kelly Olynyk, Demarcus Cousins, 6500. I love, I love them. I love all them guys right there, though, man. Kelly Olynyk, one of my favorite plays, man. And um, if I didn't mention people, I mean Jeremy Land, small four. That's a, that's a sleeper. If you want to go look at him. Jeremy Lamb, 5,100. You know, I think I hit all the plays I like for today, man. Let's go get some money, man. Let's cash out everyone. Like the page, subscribe to my channel. You feel like this video is helpful, man? Like it. That's all I want you to do, man. You know, I'm not here to construct lineups. I'm just here to give you guys great lineups and great picks, man. Um, until next time, I'm out. The games come on um, 6, 6.30 tonight, Central Time. Um, you know, get a little extra time, make lineups, do a re research. But y'all just got to sit and wait for injury news because I'm pretty sure it will be a lot of news today, man. Um, until next time, also, you can follow your boy on Twitter or DFS Greatness on Twitter. You know, need any fantasy help, advice, I'm here. Until next time, I'm out. Good luck, everyone. Betting videos coming up next. Um, if you guys like betting, prop bets, parlays, and everything for NBA, I'm about to drop one out. Let's get to it.